Hello friends, welcome to a 360 degree video tour of our incredible listing in Dixie Springs. This video is shot in beautiful 6K, 360 degree. So if you put your finger on a screen, kind of in the area of my shirt and follow me around, you will see that the camera will rotate wherever you follow it. If you're watching this on your mobile device, you can just turn in the direction you'd like to see. And at any point you can pause and take a closer look at the details. Folks, if you're watching this video, this property is currently available for sale and it is offered at 1,350,000. This home has four bedrooms, four and a half bathrooms. It's about 2,962 square feet. It sits on a quarter acre lot and it has a massive 1,800 square foot double RV garage plus a two car garage. Let's take a closer look at this incredible property. I cannot wait to show you what is inside. It is a custom home and you notice custom touches the second you pull up into the driveway. You enter this home through a massive steel door and as you enter the property, you notice right away this monorail floating custom open airy staircase that takes you in the upper loft area. And as you advance down this hallway, you see a modern light fixture on your right and this area opens to a massive, this hallway opens to a massive living room, dining room, and a custom kitchen area. What I really love about this part of this home is that the ceilings have a custom accent detail. There's modern light fixtures. There's really a lot going on in this area and it's all very tastefully done. Starting with this accent wall in the living room, that is made entirely out of tile and it has a space to hang a massive TV with a little bit of shiplap on the edge of this wall. Directly behind me, we have three massive windows that allow tons of natural light. And this area has a large slider that opens to the backyard patio. Kitchen in this home is equipped with a commercial side-by-side -side fridge next to a massive prep area with a large uh, quartz solid surface countertop with a five burner gas grill or gas cooktop. Directly across, we have a massive, um, massive center island with a prep sink, lots of cabinetry below, and directly behind me, we have custom cabinets throughout going up this massive wall and as you can see, the ceilings are nearly 24 feet tall in this home, I believe. We have some modern light fixtures up above. We have a second sink next to a massive window, dishwasher, wall oven with a wall microwave. And my personal favorite touch is of course, the hidden pantry. This home has a very impressive hidden pantry that closes as a part of the cabinetry directly as you enter this hidden pantry it has a nice coffee table finish in this corner uh, with some room for a coffee bar some upper cabinets some base cabinets and more cabinets on this side as well as tons of shelf space to your right to store whatever it is you like to store there i'd like to give you guys an opportunity to take in this space from one more angle I absolutely love how airy and open and grand it feels. Lots of natural light from the windows to the south. Massive privacy in the backyard from your rear neighbors. And of course, it opens up to this grand foyer with large floating staircase. And I absolutely love how this level of this property had turned out. As we look at this foyer of this property, I'd like you guys to take a look up above me. Here we have a beautiful modern light fixture that lights up this area quite well. And I don't really think that the light is attributed solely to the light fixture. There's also a massive window that opens to the north that lets in, again, tons of natural light into this area. As we turn left from the front door, this takes us into a guest suite portion of this home. 
guest suite has a door that opens into a powder bathroom, and it is a really good sized powder bath that has a single vanity, a toilet, beautiful floating vanity with solid surface countertop and under lighting. And as we continue down this hallway, now it takes us into a guest suite or a casita. This room has lots of space. You could probably fit a king size bed in here. There is a large upper window that allows plenty of natural light and gives you privacy from the corner of this property. And here we have a massive slider that takes you outside into a private courtyard. Now this home is just a few days out from getting a certificate of occupancy, so some of the things are still being finished. This casita has its own ensuite. The ensuite is finished with a beautiful floating vanity. I apologize for that light in the mirror not being yet mounted. Our electrician is coming back to finish those touches, but don't let that distract you from this incredible walk-in shower with beautiful floor to ceiling tile with beautiful penny tile detail on the bottom. And of course, the glass door that allows you to keep the warm air in as you're taking a morning shower. Folks, this hallway takes you from the main living space into a owner's wing of this home. Now, as we stand here, there are two different ways to enter primary bedroom or the owner's suit in this property. You could enter it directly through this door or you could enter it through a laundry room that is attached to master dressing, that is attached to master bath, that is attached to the primary bedroom in this home. The owner's suite in this property is quite spacious. It has six can lights and a fan fixture, as well as a massive slider that opens to the backyard. Now the backyard of this property is intentionally left unfinished because this space is begging for an elegant pool because it gives you just enough space and plenty of privacy to enjoy that. So we figured that it is best left untouched. That way you don't have to do a whole bunch of demo work prior to putting it in. This owner suite also features a beautiful modern bathroom. The ensuite that is attached to this owner suite is absolutely incredible. It features a dual sink vanity that is also finished in a flowing fashion with under lighting, incredible tile work on the floor, soaking tub with beautiful gold fixtures, accent wall above it, frosted windows on this side of the room. And here we have a massive glass shower. And here we have a massive glass shower with beautiful fixtures attached to the wall. I absolutely love all of the finishes that were made by our designer. Again, ceiling to floor tile with beautiful panty tile finish on the bottom. Water closet is directly across from the shower, and this gives you another perspective on the owner suite bath. I think it is one of my favorite touches about this home. Owner suite dressing is a very good size, has plenty of built-ins, plenty of rods to hang things on, and it has a door that takes you into an owner's bath, and the second door takes you into the laundry room. This laundry room has beautiful custom upper cabinets that match the rest of the cabinets in this home. It has a sink and the washer hookup as well as the dryer hookup. And this property is designed for an electric or a gas dryer. So you have options there. Folks, now we're in the mud room and I will take you into one of the most exciting parts about this home. And if you're looking at this listing, chances are you're interested in this beautiful garage. This garage is absolutely massive. It has a two car bay right here where I'm standing, as well as a double RV garage. As you can see, this RV garage is quite spacious. It has a clean out built into the floor. There is a 50 amp connection on the exterior side and there's also plumbing for water supply if you decided to park your coach in here 
and have a hook top. This bay has extra height on the ceilings, extra height on the doors, as well as extra width. You could comfortably park a boat in a Class A motorhome or two Class A motorhomes or a various combination of whatever toys your heart desires. There's certainly no shortage of garage space. And on the other side of this garage, we have some extra parking if that isn't enough. Let's head upstairs and check out the upper loft area. I absolutely love this elegant floating staircase as it takes us to the loft that's situated directly above the two car garage portion of the garage. These steps are finished in beautiful butcher block and they're attached to a very solid metal beam and all of the railing is elegantly done with these metal cords that run across the vertical bars. It has beautiful symmetry and I absolutely love this touch. It feels very chic, very modern. This area of the loft feels very airy, very open, and you could pretty much see the entire living space from here. One of my favorite touches is of course this elegant railing that keeps this very open yet safe. And to the north, we have this beautiful slider that takes us out onto the balcony where you could sit down, have a cup of coffee or maybe a glass of wine, enjoy the sunset, or just stare at the beautiful Pine Valley Mountain. In the winter time, we have a dusting of snow, but it is still nice and warm here in sunny Hurricane. There are two bedrooms on this level and this beautiful patio connects the loft area as well as one of these bedrooms. This bedroom is possibly one of my most favorite bedrooms in this home because it has incredible views. This patio allows tons of natural light. You have amazing views to the north, unobstructed views of Pine Valley Mountain, and you could comfortably fit a king size bed in here. This room has a fan fixture and six can lights up above, and it has an ensuite. As I mentioned earlier in this video, this home has four bedrooms and four and a half bathrooms. So every room in this house has an ensuite. This particular ensuite has a dual vanity with under cabinet lighting and a beautiful walk-in shower. This shower is finished in incredible floor to ceiling tile, has a beautiful black fixture and a nice glass door to keep the temperature stable as you shower. The second bedroom in this loft area has two large windows. It is also quite a spacious bedroom and it is very similar in size to the owner suite down below. This bedroom has a frosted window to the south, a nice see-through window, picture window to the right here, and it also has an ensuite. The ensuite is finished in a very similar fashion to the rest of the bathrooms that we have seen in this home. It also has a dual floating vanity, two modern mirrors, two modern light fixtures, and a beautiful shower. This is probably one of the smaller showers in this property, but it still has floor to ceiling tile, penny tile on a floor, and a beautiful glass door that keeps things nice and insulated. Folks, this is it for the tour of this property. The sun is beginning to set. I will include some drone footage to give you a better feel for this area. I am curious to know, how do you feel about these 360 degree tours? Do they make you feel like you're right here in person? Do you find them a bit distracting? Do you love them? Do you hate them? What do you think? Drop me a comment below. And of course, if you're interested in getting a private tour of this home, or if you perhaps would like to submit an offer, please do not hesitate. My contact information is in the description below this video. And I will also link this video to a more cinematic in-depth tour of this home. Questions, comments, concerns, please reach out to me. I absolutely love to hear from you. Thank you, and I will see you in the next one.